Uh, would you consider your, yourself the kind of the pioneer in Central Florida for the women's lane of the marketing style that you do? I'm definitely a trailblazer. Do you feel like people try to follow a blueprint? Maybe that you've kind of... Of course. Definitely. Like, I know for... A okay, when I... When when the situation with me and Tony Boy stopped, as far as management, because we still, like I said, we still rocking. I was like, dang, you know, I, I made a, because that's my boy. I was like, I'm not managing nobody else. I'm going to do something else in this industry, but I don't want to manage anymore. Because if I'm not managing Tony Boy, on, you know, on that level, like that just made me go sit back, revamp. I created this lane of artist development, music consultancy to where, you know, it's kind of like still doing the things that a manager does. But without the title or the commitment of being a manager. So what I, I said I do, you know what? This is the thing that a lot of these up and coming or independent or local artists aren't getting. They're not getting these shows. They're not getting to go on the road. They're not getting to get interviewed. They don't know where to start. They don't know what to do. So that's where I came in and I created that to where you pay me and I'll do the work, setting it up, teaching you, providing you with the, the fundamentals and my, my main thing is like, yeah, I like to get the artists outside the local demographic, make them hit the streets, teach them how to build engagement, teach them how to network, teach them, you know, how to go to that next level. So I, I know that I've been, I'm, I'm definitely a trailblazer in, in this industry when it comes to what I do and for women. Shout out to black women in music though. Do you feel like you get enough credit for what you have done definitely for don't get enough credit but do you feel like that's because there's so many people trying to replicate what you're doing i mean to be honest with you they could they could take the sauce but you know the cake ain't gonna come out the same and that's just keeping it a hundred times a hundred so yeah you know what i'm saying like and and that's fine because i'm not i'm humble and I'm a person that loves to work with other people and I don't mind trying to, you know, help, encourage and motivate. Cause I, I got, to be honest with you, I got where I am by being a humble beast. And I'm, I'm very humble, but I'm a beast at what I do. And I just don't understand how a person or people would like look over me, look over what I do, but still want to utilize me and utilize what I do and try not to, you know, give me the credit or, or, the attention to what I'm worth. I am very valuable. I'm very valuable. And now y'all ain't got no choice but to start treating me as such because we finna be popping.